Today, we're gonna to hear about Jesus as our eternal Father and Prince of Peace. We gotta let go of our independence and look to Jesus, our eternal Father. And when we do, he gives us a place to belong, he gives us his purpose, and he provides for us. A lot of times we look around to different things to try to give us a place to belong, but, but Jesus wants to place us in a home, a local church, a family on mission, where we can do life together. We experience that sense of belonging to the degree that we allow others into our lives. In other words, we have to be authentic with our good, bad, and ugly in order for us to truly be known, loved, and challenged. When Ted said that um, God gives us purpose and also God, God provides, as I'm graduating next year, God will provide no matter what path I take. God has a purpose for our lives and he wants to lead us into that purpose. What if we look to Jesus, our eternal Father, and followed his leading and pursued his purpose for our lives as we go into 2022. When we embrace Jesus as our eternal father, we experience peace. You know, I hate making commitments into stuff because sometimes I feel like I'm gonna get let down or I'm not gonna fulfill those. So the way he was just talking about not being independent and depending on God and depending on the word and stuff, that that is something I really going to try to do and go for it because it's something I really need in my life. So if we want the kind of peace that only the Prince of Peace can give, we got to surrender to Jesus and put the full weight of our trust in him. I think being able to just let go of our independence and like put our trust in him is something that's really difficult. But if we could get to that point, and it's also just comforting knowing like if we do that, then God will provide for us. He knows our path and that like basically our life is in his hands. You know, it says only the rebellious dwell in a parched land. So as long as you turn to God, you will have a place of belonging. You will have a provider. He will provide for you and you will have also a plan. Like he already has a plan for you. So it doesn't matter how strong you are in your own eyes. It only matters how much you're willing to follow God. 